welcome back to the course so this week five and we're going to be talking about dealing ranges so what's dealing range dealing range is the current it's just simply the current high and low that you're working with after marking your highs and lows and you'll be able to figure out what the trend is whether it's going up or it's going down so dealing range is a particular most current trend that you are working with okay this particular current trend that you're looking for trades now let me tell you something you need to understand the reason why you're letting highs and lows in the market is because for every high and low every of these are dealing ranges okay so as you can see between this high and low we have a full um range here so we call this dealing range between here and here everything that goes on inside this place was going to determine if price would crash to this low or crash to the high okay we have a high and a low whatever goes on inside here is going to determine if price is going to crash down or go up so now we are in this current dealing range now this is what we call dealing range right i usually refer to as most current high and low it's called the dealing range okay dealing range is because this is where you look to look for trades on understand the market movement try to get involved because whenever there is a dealing range meaning a high and a low a most recent high and low price is going to go to either of the ways either high or low price either going to go drop down or continue going up okay so for you to be able to predict to know when price whether it's going to go down or it's going to go up there are so many things you're going to learn in this course and all of them are going to take place in this dealing range okay all the activities that is going to show up that's going to make you know to determine whether it's going to go higher or lower is going to happen in this dealing range so as simple as it is so let's look for chart example the low that cost it which is this this low led to this high okay and then price you know played around inside now between this high and this low is what we call dealing range so the activities that happen in between this high and low is going to tell us whether price is going to go higher or lower so if it gives signs that it's going to go higher we know what to do which you're going to learn as the course proceeds but you're learning dealing range right now so this between this high and this low is called the dealing range so when price escapes we open a new dealing range which is between uh between this high and if we trace it back to the low that cost it where's the low that cost it the lowest low that led to this is going to be this low so as you can see this is the low right here this is the low like right here as you can see it's here so this low led to this high so around this time if i take if i take my replay backwards you would see something around this time we had a new uh, dealing range as you can see we just broke a high this high and we are forming a new high and price is trying to pull back so this is a new dealing range so whatever data price shows us here whatever team price does here are all the signs needed to know if you're going to go higher to break previous high we're going to go lower to break previous low as simple as it sounds right so watch we actually broke out of the range again now once we break out of the range we are going to form a new dealing range so that new dealing range is going to be between this look this low that broke this high and when price is ready to pull back we can establish it as a high now you see price is ready to pull back now this new dealing range between this low and this high okay so that's what dealing range means all right so see you in the next video